Hello, it's Graham again, and I'm going to show you the process I use for cleaning my artifacts up. Very similar to the one when I showed you how to clean your, your bronze Roman coins and other things. Uh, this is an artifact here, look. It's a um, rather interesting piece. It's actually a cockerel. We think it's a child's toy from the 16th, 15th, 16th century. As you can see, it's full of mud. So what I do with this is, is again, dry it out, make sure it's nice and dry. Um, and just use this toothpick to get round its detail. You can see the mud coming off. This is actually in, more ingrained um, than some of the Roman coins. But if just gently spend some time lifting that mud out, and you can see it coming. You can see all that. Uh, lovely mud lifting off and obviously on the back we've also got here its fixings quite a lot of mud still left around the sides and in between once this is complete it may take some time actually on some artifacts because obviously a lot bigger in coins so you have to really spend some time and an effort doing it but it's worth it um, and then again on to the next process back again with the again dry light bristle brush you need a toothbrush a couple of pound toothbrush but make sure it's not too hard on the bristles and what I can do here is the mud's coming off nicely as you can see but you can also repeat that on the back To make sure all that mud is starting to lift. Now what the brush does, it lifts the mud out with the bristles. It's starting to loosen it up, as you can see. So I have a little bit of a pick with the brush. And I can see now more detail coming through on its tail feathers. And there we go. Melanie's not going to be too happy for me doing this on the kitchen worktop, but it's handy and it's warm. And what she doesn't see won't do her any harm. Okay, and on to the next process. Back again, and I am now beginning to get rid of all the um, mud. There's still a little bit on there, that's going to take a little bit more time. I can also apply wax to this to secure the patina and everything on the artifact. But as you can see, there's a lot more detail there showing up. You may have seen this next to the cockerel I'm cleaning up. This is also a mid this is a medieval seal, as you can see with the Lamb of God on. This is going to take some time. It's got quite a bit of staining in and around the seal. So again, this is a blunt toothpick, it's not sharp at all. I've made sure it's blunt and I'm just working my way around all the detail getting all the mud out as you can see it's difficult on this because it's more staining the mud but on the on the shank and the sides it's actually starting to lift and then what I'll do with that one is once it's all clean wax it up ready to be displayed. So on to the next process and final one. And then we have uh, the final product if that's the right word. That's now the cockerel in its little display case. Clean, the mud's mostly off it. I can have another go at it maybe next week but uh, that can now be displayed nicely for everybody to see. I hope that helps anyway. Thank you.